Hello everybody, I'm Ricky Smith. Welcome to Faith on Friday. As humans, we are hardwired for social interaction. Human connection in social settings is as good for the brain as the gym is for your body. When connecting with others, your mind is active. It's alert and agile. Picking up social cues, listening, interpreting, responding, and your pleasure sensor is on fire. Building social networks improves cognitive skills. It can prevent mental decline and can lower the risk of dementia. Isolation, on the other hand, is as harmful to the brain as smoking 15 cigarettes a day. We are people and we want to connect. We want to be a part of something, to belong. We want to be identified with a group, a community, a family, or a team. But lasting connects come from an authentic place of love and peace. It never comes from fear, from pain, or from self-loathing. Those relationships, they don't last and can be detrimental for your health. We are genetically predisposed to human interaction, and we long for the benefits that meaningful, deep, and loving connections offer. Feelings of happiness, purpose, self-worth, confidence, and a resiliency after experiencing a hardship that only comes after being connected with someone. So let's connect. It's time to stop hiding behind our devices. Look up. Be fully present in any social environment. Make sure to learn about other people and stop telling all the time about yourself. Smile and be courteous. In a world where everything is virtual, take some time, embrace the opportunity to share, to reach out, and to build lasting relationships that connect not just for now, but for a lifetime. Thank you everybody for watching and thank you so much for sharing the video. If you haven't already, subscribe to our YouTube channel, give us a thumbs up, and leave us a comment. My name is Ricky Smith and I'll see you next Friday.